Welcome to Mellow Tone In. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. For more stories like the one you are about to hear, please like and subscribe. Thank you. I stood at the edge of a tranquil, mystical forest, its majesty stretching out before me like a masterful painting. Ancient trees towered towards the heavens, their gnarled trunks bearing the wisdom of countless years. A delicate mist hung low, wrapping the forest in an enchanting shroud that whispered of the mysteries hidden within its depths. The path before me, a narrow trail of well-trodden earth, was dappled with sunlight. Rays of dawn's first light danced down from the canopy, creating an intricate pattern of light and shadow on the path. It beckoned me like a gentle invitation, luring me deeper into the heart of the woodland with the promise of undiscovered wonders and serene solitude. As I stepped onto the path, I was met with the soft crunch of fallen leaves underfoot. Each footfall was a note in the forest's melody, a sound that seemed as integral to the forest as the chirping of birds or the whisper of the wind. The ground beneath was a carpet of leaves in countless shades of red, orange, and gold, their colors a tribute to the changing seasons. I ventured further in, enveloped by the ethereal beauty of the forest. The trees rose high above me, their branches intertwined to form a high canopy, a natural cathedral that dwarfed the world below. This overhead lacework of leaves was a living kaleidoscope, filtering the early morning light into a myriad of captivating hues. This dappled light painted a mesmerizing pattern on the forest floor, creating a world that seemed borrowed from a dream. Every rustle of the leaves, every bird call echoing through the silent woods, every breath of the cool earth-scented air brought a wave of peace. As I journeyed deeper, the forest and I became one, the beat of nature's heart, sinking with my own. The forest around me was a living orchestra, each component playing its own harmonious part in the symphony of nature. From somewhere in the distance, the delicate rustle of a deer stepping through the underbrush reached my ears. Each rustling whisper seemed to punctuate the stillness, a gentle reminder of the other lives being lived within the forest's embrace. Accompanying this was the chorus of the morning birds, their sweet songs drifting down from the canopy above. Each unique melody blended with the next, creating a beautiful tapestry of sound that filled the air with joy. Their notes rang out clear and bright, intertwining with the ambient sounds of the forest to form a lullaby of the early morning. Woven through this tapestry was the soft sigh of the wind as it danced through the branches overhead. It was a gentle serenade, a soothing hum that swirled around me, playing with fallen leaves and teasing the treetops into a slow waltz. The rhythm of the wind was the forest's heartbeat, a constant, comforting presence that brought a sense of unity to the chorus of the forest. The air itself was cool, a refreshing contrast to the warm dapple of sunlight that filtered through the leaves. It was laced with the fresh aroma of the forest floor, the unmistakable scent of dew-kissed ferns and moss mingling with the earthy undertones of the woodland. This was the perfume of the forest, a scent as ancient and as renewing as nature itself. As I breathed in, drawing in the cool, fragrant air, a profound sense of calm washed over me. It was as if the forest itself was sharing its serenity, its age-old tranquility seeping into my bones with every breath I took. In that moment, I was not just within the forest. I was a part of it, connected by the shared song of life that echoed around me. As the day gently surrendered to the velvet blanket of twilight, the forest transformed adopting a mysterious yet calming guise. The realm of towering trees and rustling underbrush was slowly becoming a haven of silhouettes and whispers, every shadow holding a serene secret. The last golden rays of the setting sun wove through the forest canopy like molten threads, their warm light weaving an ethereal tapestry. This dying light seemed to ignite the leaves, making them shimmer with an otherworldly glow that was a sight to behold. The greens deepened into richer, darker hues, while patches of foliage sparkled as if studded with the most precious of gems. As the sun dipped below the horizon, it ushered in the ensemble of the night. Creatures of the dusk began their quiet symphony, an orchestration quite unlike the melodies of the day. The hoot of an owl echoed through the stillness, a solitary note in the growing sonnet of the night. Crickets lent their rhythm to the mix, their continuous lullaby a soothing serenade that formed the baseline of the twilight music. 
The wind, too, altered its song as day gave way to night. The playful dance of the afternoon breeze had mellowed into a gentle whisper, a caress that rustled the leaves and boughs in a soft, comforting symphony. It was as if the forest itself was whispering lullabies, each sigh of the wind a soothing hum that promised safety and rest. The transition from day to night within the forest was a magical experience, a gentle journey from light into darkness, a gradual unveiling of a new world full of tranquil charm and peace. Out of the twilight tranquility, an unexpected sight greeted me. There, nestled amidst the towering trees, stood a charming inn, its timbers blending harmoniously with the woodland around it. It was as if it had magically materialized in the heart of the forest, seamlessly woven into the tapestry of the serene environment. The inn seemed to radiate a warm golden light from its windows, casting a welcoming glow in the encroaching night. This luminescence was like a beacon amidst the forest's twilight symphony, a guiding star that gently broke through the curtain of darkness, promising safety and comfort. The structure of the inn was as enchanting as its presence was comforting. It was as if this haven had sensed my deep-rooted weariness, a human longing that stirred a response from the enchanted forest. The inn seemed to manifest itself in answer to my silent call, a tangible symbol of the forest's nurturing spirit, embodying the magical essence of its surroundings. Above the welcoming entrance, a beautifully crafted sign swayed gently with the breeze, the words, Welcome to the Mellow Tone Inn, etched deeply into its surface. This simple greeting felt as warm as the soft glow emanating from within the inn, inviting me towards the comfort and solace it offered. The light that spilled from its window panes painted the woodland floor in hues of amber and gold, creating a pathway that guided me towards the inn's wooden doors. This soft, inviting radiance held a promise a pledge of warmth and respite within the inn's comforting walls. As I drew nearer, I could already sense the profound tranquility awaiting me within the mellow tone inn, a tranquil sanctuary nestled in the heart of the mystical forest. The moment I crossed the threshold of the mellow tone inn, I was immediately enveloped in an atmosphere that felt like a comforting embrace. The inn exuded an undeniable sense of comfort and homeliness as if every beam and stone had been designed to welcome and soothe weary travelers. Inside, the air was wonderfully warm, filled with a comforting warmth that gently seeped into my skin, caressing away the evening chill. It was a soothing warmth, the kind that started at your fingertips and slowly spread, melting away the weariness of the day. The atmosphere was intoxicating, laced with a myriad of scents that immediately lulled me into a state of relaxation. The rich, earthy aroma of burning wood filled the space, reminding me of cozy winter nights spent before a roaring fire. This comforting scent was intertwined with the faint but fragrant scent of dried herbs, a soothing blend of chamomile, lavender, and mint, adding an element of tranquility to the atmosphere. More than just visually inviting, the inn was a symphony of soft, mellow tones. It was as though the very walls of the structure, made from ancient forest timber, held countless stories, and they hummed these tales in soothing melodies. The faint creak of the aged wood, the distant echo of a lullaby seemingly carried in the breeze, all harmonized into a gentle song that resonated throughout the inn. The Mellow Tone Inn was more than just a shelter in the forest. It was a haven, a sanctuary away from the rest of the world. Stepping inside was akin to stepping into a different realm, a refuge insulated from the weight of the world outside. The day's journey, no matter how enchanting, bore a weight of its own, a weight that seemed to lift as I ventured further into the inn's warm embrace. To my immediate left, a collection of plush armchairs huddled around a crackling fireplace. They stood like a welcoming committee, their plump forms and velvety upholstery creating an enticing visual invitation to rest. These armchairs, with their generous proportions and inviting cushioning, were clad in the softest velvet that shimmered subtly under the flickering firelight. They seemed to beckon me, whispering silent promises of sublime comfort and relaxation, offering to cradle my weary body within their cozy embrace. The fireplace was the merry heart of the room, its flames dancing a hypnotic ballet within the confines of the stone hearth. The fire was not merely a source of warmth, but also a spectacle of serenity its shifting light casting an enchanting play of shadows and reflections throughout the room. As the flames flickered and swayed, they painted the walls and ceiling with a soft golden light that brought life to every corner, 
adding an extra layer of magic to the comforting environment. Directly across from this welcoming scene, an exquisitely aged wooden table stood, its surface polished by time and countless hands. It bore a spread that seemed straight out of a painting, with an array of cups positioned thoughtfully across its length. From each cup, tendrils of steam spiraled gently upwards, carrying with them the enticing aroma of a carefully curated blend of herbs. This fragrance, a soothing symphony of chamomile, mint, and a hint of lavender, perfumed the air around the table. Each scent was distinct yet perfectly blended, promising a cup of calming herbal tea that was the epitome of serenity. It seemed to say that each sip would not merely warm my body, but also soothe my spirit, making it an ideal companion to an evening dedicated to relaxation in the heart of the enchanted forest. Beyond the communal space, a sturdy wooden door stood slightly ajar, the edge of a cozy sanctuary peeping out to invite me in. The warm, soft glow of a lamp spilled out onto the polished wooden floor of the hallway, pools of golden light that seemed to drip with the promise of comfort. The glow was a beacon in the relatively dim inn, a shining invitation guiding me towards the tranquility waiting behind the door. Stepping inside, I found the room was a haven of solitude. It held an atmosphere of absolute tranquility, a sense of privacy and peace that felt as though it had been carefully crafted and reserved just for me. It was a space separate from the rest of the world, a cocoon that existed solely for the purpose of my rest and recuperation. Approaching the bed, I was struck by its inviting allure. The mattress, adorned with a scattering of plump, oversized pillows and draped in the softest linens, seemed to beckon me. The sheets, a serene shade of pastel blue, were smooth and cool to the touch, hinting at the comfort that awaited beneath. As I surrendered to the bed's call and let myself sink into its inviting embrace, I found myself engulfed in an exquisite cloud of softness. It was as if the bed had anticipated every contour of my weary body, molding itself to provide the ultimate comfort. The sturdy mattress supported me, while the plush pillows cradled my head, creating a perfect harmony of softness and firmness. In this perfect sanctuary, every ounce of tension that had built up in my body throughout the day seemed to simply melt away. Each muscle relaxed, every thought quieted, and I was left with an overwhelming sense of peace and comfort. It was a feeling of complete surrender, of allowing myself to be carried away by the enveloping tranquility that the Mellow Tone Inn offered. In the heart of the forest, tucked within the nurturing embrace of the Mellow Tone Inn, sleep approached me like a gentle old friend. It wasn't sudden or abrupt, but a gentle transition, a slow wave that washed over me with a soothing familiarity. The outside world, with its constant hustle and relentless noise, seemed to exist in another plane altogether its chaotic rhythm drowned by the serene symphony of the forest and the inn. The whispers of the forest were soft and soothing, a lullaby composed by nature itself. The faint rustling of leaves swaying in the cool night breeze, the distant hoot of an owl perched on a high branch, and the faint chirping of nocturnal critters hidden among the ferns and bushes. Each sound was a character in a bedtime story told by the forest, each whisper a gentle narrative of the woodland's tranquility its ceaseless cycle of life, and the magic held in its hidden corners. While the forest whispered its lullaby, the mellow tone in wrapped me in a blanket of warmth and comfort, its cozy atmosphere adding to the sense of tranquility. Every sound within the inn played a role in my journey towards sleep. The comforting crackle of the fire in the hearth, the mellow sound of teacups being arranged for the morning, the soft sigh of the wind as it whispered against the window pane, all created a soothing soundscape. The inn itself seemed to have a pulse, a soft melody that hummed through its wooden walls and stone floors. This rhythm was harmonious with the cadence of the forest outside, weaving together into a symphony that was both familiar and enchanting. Together, the forest's lullaby and the inn's gentle hum orchestrated my surrender to the night, leading me towards a peaceful, rejuvenating sleep. As I lay there, Comfortably nestled in the plush softness of the bed, I found myself teetering on the blissful brink of slumber. I didn't fight it or force it. Instead, I chose to surrender. Surrender to the rhythmic lullaby of the forest, 
to the soothing hum that seemed to resonate within the very bones of the Mellow Tone Inn, to the quiet symphony that had guided me throughout this magical journey. Each sound, each note, was a guide leading me gently towards the realm of dreams. Their harmonious chorus rose like a gentle tide, effortlessly drowning out any lingering thoughts or worries, leaving me with a sense of profound calm and peace. Sleep was not a sudden visitor, but rather a welcomed conclusion. It arrived not as an abrupt end, but as a smooth extension of the day's tranquility. It felt like the natural progression of my day, from waking in the serene dawn, journeying through the mystical forest, to finding sanctuary within the welcoming walls of the Mellow Tone Inn. Each step had been imbued with a sense of peace and quiet wonder, and sleep was simply the next step in this enchanted journey. As I drifted off, I felt a sense of profound safety and comfort. I was not merely sleeping in a room, I was cradled within the heart of the forest, enveloped within the comforting embrace of the Mellow Tone Inn.